hello and welcome back to another video in the kitchen with pen and what am i making today well basically it's our dinner um it's something i just started craving last night no i'm not pregnant girls don't worry um, i just really had this craving for well come and have a look well it is smoked haddock which I'm going to serve on a bed of wilted spinach topped with a poached egg and then I'm going to use these ingredients that I'm just about to show you and I wonder if you know what it's going to be so I've got some beautiful French butter I've got some eggs and I'm only going to be using the yolks and I've got some uh, but with lemon and I'm going to be using lemon juice any ideas what it is yet? Well, it's going to be, as I say, poached haddock on a bed of wilted spinach, topped with a poached egg and finished, keep your fingers crossed for me, with a hollandaise sauce. I'm going to show you how I make poached eggs because that's you know it's easy i'm not going to show you how i do the fish because you just poach it in water it's a piece of cake spinach just wilt it down in a pan add a little nutmeg some salt and pepper if you like but the hollandaise i'm going to be making in my thermo mix which i haven't showed you using it yet showed you haven't showed you me using it yet so come along whilst we make our dinner you know what i've just said oh yeah and i'm gonna make the hollandaise sauce in my thermomix and I suddenly thought actually some of you might not know what a thermomix is well a thermomix is an all-in-one machine that weighs chops grinds grates and cooks um, this was bought for me by my lovely friends when I was going through throat cancer this meant that I could continue to eat because I could cook in here or Steve could cook in here. The food was blended up and I could actually swallow. So they are a great machine, very expensive. Um, I don't, it's not something you need, should we put it that way, but it's excellent. So let's have a look at what's in here, shall we? Right, so ooh, in my thermi, I have 130 grams of butter, 20 grams of lemon juice, and four egg yolks. So all I'm gonna do now is to put the lid on. Lid is on, I'm just going to pop this in here as well. I'm going to cook for eight minutes, so I need to set the timer for eight minutes. Oh, goodness me. Go so slow to start and then all of a sudden eight minutes <coughs> excuse me <coughs> i want it to get to 90 degrees so i'm going to press that one and i want it on speed three right and that's just gonna sort of splash out then that's going to do its thing for the next eight minutes. I need to do nothing else. Right, can you see all that spinach in there? That's just going to wilt down. I'm going to pop a lid on. And to be honest, when that's done, you'll wonder what I put in there. My water is boiling, ready for the poached eggs. In the water, I've got a touch of salt and a splash of white vinegar. And my haddock is just poaching away just there. Right, as you can see, the water is just getting to a little bubble. So I'm going to stir it to create a vortex. And then I'm just going to gently lower my fresh eggs that I did crack into ramekins into it. The vortex helps the white, allegedly, form over the yolks. So now I just need to leave those on a low heat, just poaching away 
for two to three minutes. Eggs are cooked now. I've taken them out and I've popped them onto a piece of kitchen towel and they're ready to go. It's got decidedly quieter in here so that means that the hollandaise is cooked too. So next thing you'll see is the hollandaise. Right then there's our spinach, our smoked haddock and our poached egg. Believe it or not, all that spinach there is everything that was in the pan. So let's have a look at this hollandaise and let's keep our fingers crossed that it's good. Oh, it looks like it's split. I don't know, hold on, let's switch. No, it's okay, it hadn't split. It's absolutely fine, as you can hopefully see there. So I'm just going to pour that over my dinner. And there we go. Smoked salmon on a bed of wilted spinach, topped with a poached egg and hollandaise sauce. I'd better test it, hadn't I? Let's have a look. The haddock looks beautiful. Get some of that. Oh, right, I've got haddock and I've got some of the sauce. Now, I'm going to be honest, it's not the best hollandaise I've ever made. Mm -hmm. But I am getting that lovely lemon. So, all that remains to say is thank you for watching this edition of In the Kitchen with Pen. If you've liked it, please give us a thumbs up. Um, any comments, write them down below and I'll see you again very soon with another edition In the Kitchen with Pen. Bye bye. If you like what we're doing, don't forget to give us a like. If you'd like to subscribe, Click on our picture here. If you want to see more videos of what we get up to, click here. Thanks for watching. Bye.